And now for some of the stories that you'll find on TBD.com. A sign of success for a species of birds known as the white-naped cranes. Their population is being regrown in captivity through artificial insemination. TBD segment producer Hilary Esquina shows us the process. The white-naped cranes are endangered. There's less than 5,000 in the wild, and there's 59 in the U.S. at zoos that are involved with uh, the species survival plan, and we have 12 of them, so we have about 23%. And the reasons we're able to do so well with them is we have a lot of extra space, and we're closed to the public, too, so there's a lot less disturbance here than at other zoos. We've been involved with the uh, white nape cranes back since the early 80s and been involved in the SSP and captive management since those started with these birds. Hey, pretty girl. The species survival plan um, is managed as an insurance population in case the wild population goes extinct. The breeding is dictated um, by a stud book. It's kind of like computer dating uh, for birds where they mix and match and see whose genetics match up the best. This is Walnut. She's a white nape crane. It was hand raised at another institution. They were sent to us by the SSP because they're very genetically valuable because of their underrepresentation, uh, and they wanted their genes represented in the gene pool. So they sent them to us because we can do assisted reproduction. We ended up having to do artificial insemination. Because she's this tame and I can get this close to her, we were actually able to do artificial insemination without restraint. You know, if you're talking to anyone who's done artificial insemination with cranes, it's actually quite remarkable to be even able to train them to do that. His name is Cal. He was born this year back in May. In the last five years, we've produced seven white nape crane chicks, um, and that's more than any other institution. We'll try and breed more next year, and we may receive cranes from other zoos to pair with cranes we have, and these chicks may eventually get a mate sent here or we'll send them to another zoo to be paired. So there's a lot of cooperation among zoos. Beautiful birds. If you would like to learn more about the white-naped cranes, just head to our website, tbd.com.